Hey everybody, JRSPC here with another random pack break video and today we're doing some Chronicles football, some score 2021 and some 2021 contenders basketball. Obviously Chronicles are 2020. Um, uh, I, I really like the score. Um, <laughs> so uh, that's why I'm opening it. I, I kind of dig some of those inserts and there's, uh, you know, a few rookies in there. Uh, contenders, we just picked these up here recently. Keely got them for me for Father's Day, so I'm excited to open some of those. If you guys didn't see my last video, check it out. I just did one quick break on one pack just, just, just to check them out. It ended up being a pretty good pack. So, uh, first things first, I wanted to say thank you to, uh, to uh, let's see, one of my uh, one of my subscribers, uh, Ross and Matt, uh, Magda. And they are from Canada. Looks like they're from Toronto. Uh, got this letter in the mail here. Uh, so I'll go ahead and read it real quick. Um, it says, uh, Dear Frank Specey, it says, I'm writing you to let you know that we thoroughly enjoy your videos on YouTube, especially the ones where you write to celebrities to request their autographs. These videos uh, are so entertaining that we decided to pick up our pen and paper and begin corresponding with celebrities, politicians, and companies as well. We're not really baseball fans, but we were excited to see every time that you get a reply. We're looking forward uh, to more videos soon, and it's signed um, uh, Ross and Magda. Here you go. Uh, so Ross and Magda, thanks so much for uh, for sending that letter. I really appreciate when I get stuff like this from you guys. Um, I, I love thoughtful letters. Sometimes I'll get a postcard uh, that just people that enjoy the channel, and, and it really excites me and makes me want to do more and more of this kind of stuff. Um, going along the lines with uh, what you guys uh, like with the politicians and stuff, I just found this card I'm going to be sending out to, to Colin Powell. Um, I know he has signed through the mail fairly recently. Um, I think he's still alive. I'm trying to think now. Did I hear anything about his passing? I can't remember. But anyways, uh, if he is still um, alive, I'm going to be sending this out to him. Uh, my brother-in-law, who was a Marine for eight years, um, uh, once a Marine, always a Marine. Uh, he actually met him and got his, uh, uh, a book signed by him. So we're gonna we're gonna try to get a Colin Powell sign. So yeah, I like doing a lot of the uh, I like doing a lot of things that are not uh, sports related, like politicians and stuff like that. Um, I've been wanting to get the uh, the founder of Nike's autograph. I got his a uh, address somewhere. Uh, I gotta send it to him soon. He's pretty old, so uh, like 90 years old or something like that. But uh, <clears throat> I think he signs business cards. But anyways, okay, on to the pack break. So Ross and, and Magda, thank you so much. I really appreciate the, you guys writing me. Uh, it, it's, it always really brightens my day when I get stuff like that in the mail. So I really appreciate it. Alrighty, let's see what we get here. 2020 score, Patrick Queen, Denzel Mims. Let's try to get us some big hits. We need some big hits. Jim Kelly, Alex Smith, Utah guy. This is going in a pile for a fella that's a big fan of the Utah guys. And Anthony Miller. Ryan Tannehill, that's a pretty cool pose. I really like it. Aaron Rodgers asking God, what should I do? Should I play in Green Bay or should I give Jordan Love a chance? Uh, Michael Vick, CJ Ham, CeeDee Lamb. And that's a red. Uh, not a rookie because his rookie was last year. Let's see what else we got. Darren Waller for the red. Brevin Jordan red. That's a rookie. And then we got a Reggie Bush National Champs. Um, people call him a bust. He wasn't really a bust, but... He was not um, the super humongous star that people expect him to be, but he did have a solid career. You know, he was basically a solid football player. Jared Goff, uh, new lion, J.J. Watt. And I want to just take one second to give a shout out to my, my homies over here at Elevate Sports Card. Guys, check them out. They have a really fun channel. I'm going to be doing a break with them here probably in a week. Um, and that's going to be a lot of fun. All right, score team Christian McCaffrey, and there's our rookie, the, the 1991 style, Trey Lance. I really love this style. I'm not sure why we are blurry right now, but let's try to fix that. I don't know what's going on. What is going on, everybody? I don't know. Is that That's a little better. Okay, cool. All right, Tom Brady next level. Uh, decent stats right there for him. Adam Thielen, uh, the 3D with Sap Smith and Aaron Donald, Cam Newton score team. Okay, what else we got here? Uh, Khalil Mack, Josh Allen, uh, Cam Newton, National Champs, 2010. Here's our rookies. Uh, Jay Tufel, Micah Parsons, Kellen Mond, Brendan Knox, Devontae Smith, 
Elijah Mitchell. And then we got Micah Kaiser, uh, Marshawn Lattimore, Chris Carson, Matt Neal Nelson, sorry, Jordan Hicks, Jameis Winston, Russell Wilson, Derek Carr, some good rookie, um, quarterbacks there, Geno Atkins, Kenneth Murray, uh, Cooper Cup, Jared Cooks. Okay, so that first pack, um, what was good in it? Well, first card is dinged right there, pretty good dinging right there. <laughs> Not sure you can see it, there you go, yeah. But the rest of them seem to be pretty good. Um, Nothing huge in this one right here. I got that nice Tom Brady, uh, but still, it's not a valuable card. It's probably worth about a buck uh, at a card show. Let's do. A, let's do. A, oh, let's just keep doing score. Score's got these. Um, what are they called again? The exclusive dot go, dots gold parallels. I haven't pulled one of those yet. Um, I'd be pretty darn sick if we did. I don't even know what they look like because I haven't even looked them up to see what they look like. A lot of times, when I see a cool parallel. I'll go on eBay and look it up. Hey, got something cool and shiny right there. We'll see what that is. Is that maybe one of those? I don't know. We'll find out. Jordan Poyer, Antonio Gibson, Damian Harris, Ed Reed, the legend, and Zeke. Okay, Rodney McLeod, Zach Thomas, Big Ben, who may be just about past his prime, I think. He played pretty good last year, but I think they're looking at possibly getting rid of him. Justin Jefferson. Hey, Panini, I'm still waiting on my redemption. I have a redemption in here. For uh, Justin Jefferson, I sent in uh, 2019. I redeemed it. It's for an autograph out of Contenders Draft out of six. Still don't have it. Miles Garrett and oh, my very first favorite Mets player or Mets player, Jets player, Mark Gastonall. So if anybody knows, is this one of those gold dots? This is a beautiful card, <laughs> numbered out of uh, 225. Mark Gastonall, I got one of his autographs in my PC. Um, I'm pretty sure he's uh, he's got some health issues, so his autograph is getting worse over the years. But that's great. That is a, an original. That's my very first favorite football player, so that is freaking cool. So we're going to get that guy sleeved up for sure. Uh, let's take a look at the back here, see if it says anything. Uh, I don't know if this is a uh, one of those gold dots or not, but it sure is a beautiful foil card. All right, let me know in the comments if you guys know, and if you don't know, we'll find out. Chad Johnson, red. Jonathan Taylor, red. And a red Jalen Waddle. Nice card there. And here's our other one. Zach Wilson, BYU. Shout out down here, Provo, Utah. Right right where we, right, not, you know, not far from here. <laughs> um, that's uh, the Jets' uh, number one draft pick, so super stoked to have that thing. That'll go right in the uh, a sleeve and top loader PC there. There's uh, Larry Fitz. He'll be a Hall of Famer, definitely, I think. Derrick Henry, beast last year. Deion Sanders, Lamar, and a Justin Herbert score team. Pretty cool. Hey, there's a Trevor Lawrence, 2018 National Champs. Clemson Tigers. Shout out to my buddy Dave McElhaney. Um, huge Clemson fan. Justin Jefferson. Look at those 1,400 yards. Oh, my gosh. That guy was a freaking pretty darn beast mode last year. That's a nice Giants 3D. Some legends there. Harry Carson, Lawrence Taylor, and Michael Strahan. A Zeke, next level. And Kyler Trask. I don't think I've pulled any good Lawrence rookies uh, yet. I think the only thing I've pulled was like that uh, National Champions. Uh, Anthony Schwartz. I'm hoping to get one of those 2021 styles. Uh, I'm sorry, the, the 20th anniversary of the 1991 score. Nothing huge there in the rookie department as far as we know now. Of course, some of these guys can play well. That's why I always take these rookies. I sleeve them up, or I at least put them away somewhere safe in case they have a, a breakout year. And then we uh, we go back and we grab them out later. And and then that's when we do what we do with them. We sell them, get them graded, whatever. So that's that, guys. Pretty darn cool. All right, top card, Joe Burrow. Not too shabby. Looking forward to see what he does this year. Troy Aikman. Tom Brady, all right. Three, four good quarterbacks minus Carson Wentz. He's not very good. Um, <laughs> not bad, but he's kind of kind of fragile. Uh, LaMichael Perrine, Chris Jones, A.J. Green. All right, Austin Hooper, Ty Hilton. I'm sorry, T.Y. Hilton. I still call him Ty. Brian Erlacher, legendary um, linebacker from our generation here. Devontae, there's another Strahan. Get these turned around. Nice Michael Strahan red. Alvin Kamara, beast. Larry Roundtree the third. That's a red rookie. 
Another three deep. Drew Locke. Let's see. Charles Woodson. Drew Locke. Cover boy for playbook. No idea why in the world they picked Drew Locke. <laughs> Charles Woodson Hall of Famer. DK Metcalf. Another Tom Brady National Champion. 1997. Pretty cool. Did that pretty early in his career. Uh, in his college career anyways. Uh, Drew Brees. Next level. Chase Claypool. And there's some Vikings. Jared Allen. John Randall. Harrison Smith. Nick Chubb, beast last year. Kyle Pitts, he's going to be a good one, I think. Uh, keep a look out for him. Juju, that's going to go to my buddy Omar. He's a big fan of any USC guy, so I'll stick that in his pile. I actually have a little, a little thing over here I've been doing to save for people. So, Omar, if you're watching, i got a pile here for you, buddy. These are all uh, USC guys. And then i got another pile here for my buddy, which is supposed to be a surprise. So, Bear Cards 34. <laughs> So, uh, Brian, if you saw that, just ignore it. Okay, man? Alrighty. Terrence Marshall, rookie. Baron Browning, Elijah Mold. Hey, we got a Trevor Lawrence rookie, finally. Nice. I've opened up a good, a fair amount of these things, so finally got a Trevor Lawrence. Um, looking forward to getting a, one of those scores, but I'll take that one for now. Alrighty. Travis, um, I don't even know how to say his last name. Felipe Franks, and by the time I... Try to figure it out. I could have been done with this pack. So, Drew Locke, Michael Dixon, Heath Fells, DeAndre Hopkins, and DJ Moore. I got an authentic full-size helmet signed by him. It's a beautiful piece. Very expensive to get. It was out of one of those mystery boxes. I actually didn't um, pay for it. My buddy Larry did. And uh, that was a pretty good pull. But I ended up buying this collection off him. He decided. Um, well, long story short, it's... Uh, his wife, who is awesome, um, basically made him choose <laughs> something like that. All right, here's some 2021 contenders basketball. Let's see who we get. Chris Middleton, Tobias, Derek Rose. Who's your guys' picks for the uh, NBA Finals, and who's your guys' picks for the to win the Finals? I'm curious to see who falls who. Julius Randle, obviously I was really rooting for the Jazz. Went to game five. Um, stressful game. They had a hard time catching up. They're kind of always down by five, seven, eight points. You would get up within three, and then they would just they would just figure out a way to get down again. And Kyrie, Seku, Tatum, Devontae Graham, uh, Jusuf, Nurkic, Rudy. Three years in a row, defensive player in the year, but his defense wasn't great uh, in the postseason as far as I'm concerned. Porzingis had a couple good plays, you know, but... Uh, uh, you know, you know, I don't know. It was kind of a crappy uh, postseason. All right, Isaiah Stewart draft class and Patrick Williams red draft class. Pretty cool. Yeah, um, you know, we didn't have Conley, um, and you know, you know, heaven forbid, they actually had a what's his face. If they had a Kawhi, we would have just looked even worse. Game six, going into freaking L.A. We looked so good that whole game. 25-point lead at one point. And I think we went into the fourth quarter with a 17-point lead. We figured out a way to lose by, like, I think it was like seven or eight points. I can't remember. Pathetic, pathetic, pathetic. And freaking Donovan finally went off, too. Jimmy Butler, Sexton, DeMont. Oh, man. Game five was great. Uh, Bogey just hit so many threes in that first quarter. And then uh, even the first half, you know, and then he just forgot how to. He just he didn't score hardly anything in the second half of the game. So they're they're doing some amazing things with uh, how many threes they made, with how many attempts. All right, hey, Steph Curry goes in my PC. Drew Holiday. All right, Kyle Kuzma, Zion. Put that in the old PC. Nice green Giannis. I'm not sure that thing's not numbered or nothing, but cool card, green Giannis. Uh, Anthony Davis game night and then we got a uh, Malaki Flynn rookie and an international of uh, Drazen Petrovic he's a good guy he was a, he's a Hall of Famer uh, passed away very very young in, in his career uh, but a great international player and then a great um, became you know was a star in the NBA back in the day uh, for the for the very short time he was there but sad story there okay last pack of this. Uh, Tobias Harris, D. Rose, uh, Julius Randle again, Andrew Wiggins. We got a couple of these guys already. 
Rui, um, and Al Horford, Victor, Joker, uh, Kyrie, Sekou again. Yeah, we got a lot of these guys in the last pack. Yep, got all these guys. Yep, yep, yep. All right. Giannis, Miles Turner, uh, Green Sekou this time. Jimmy Butler game night. Uh, let's see. Goran Dragic, that's pretty cool international. And nice, uh, uh, a red Donovan game night. So I'll go right in the Donovan PC. Um, gave away a lot of Donovan and a lot of jazz cards at the game. We were there an hour before game time, and we, me and my, my good friend Chris, um, we went around and we handed out cards to kids, uh, jazz players. We would basically, we had fun. We would say, hey, can you guys uh, settle a debate for us, you know? And they'd be like, yeah, sure. And we, and we, would, we would ask them, hey, who do you think is a better player? You know, we'd be like, Rudy Gobert or... You know, uh, Paul George, and they'd be like, "Oh, Rudy." So we'd then we'd give them the card and we'd surprise them. They wouldn't know we had cards, so they were super happy. Some of them were extremely happy, and some of them I think were just creeped out. But anyways, <laughs> uh, nice Patrick Mahomes, uh, Calvin Ridley. So Patrick Mahomes going into Patrick Mahomes PC. Dalvin Cook, T Higgins rookie, Brian Dawkins. All right, Chase Claypool rookie. I got I basically got all these to. Bump up my uh, my rookies uh, for last year, so I have some for the shows. There's a nice Brandon Ayuk, Van Jefferson, and the vintage style of the Pacifics. I really like those old Omegas. Uh, nice Chase Young. That's a Don uh, clearly Donruss, I think, or whatever they called that one. Nice uh, Cam Akers. Denzel Mims for my Jets. Tyler Johnson. Cole Kmet. Uh, Brandon Ayuk. And Mr. Perrine. Pretty darn cool. Dig, dig, dig those cards. I love Chronicles. Uh, it's not a huge set. I know it's rookie heavy. I freaking love them. I don't care how many they made. I dig them. DK. Clyde Edwards, rookie. Matt Ryan, Justin, rookie. Tyler Boyd. Yeah, some good ones there so far. Julian Blackman. Nice Omega of James Robinson and DeAndre Swift. And then a Jalen Hurts playoff momentum. What a great card they made back. The style's made back in 1998. I remember that. Pretty cool. Uh, let's see. Jake Fromm. Tua. Nice Tua. Jordan Love. Shout out. Utah State. My buddy Brian. Bear Cards. His alma mater. Antonio Gibson. Jacob Eason. And another Jake Fromm. Sweet. I love these freaking Chronicles. Did I say I love them yet? Yep, I love them. Alrighty, guys. Couple more packs of these and then we'll call her quits for tonight. Hope you guys are enjoying my background um, stuff. I got some, I just threw some vintage boxes up there. Uh, early 80s stuff. Nice Aaron Rodgers out of the base chronicles. Uh, Marshall Falk. Roquan Smith. Curtis Martin. John Elway. And a Khalil Mack. And that's the bronze. And we got a nice Jerry Judy rookie. And an Antonio Gandy Golden. Pretty cool. Judy is a pretty good one. Uh, Antonio Gibson, Black Prism. That's a pretty good one right there. These Black Prisms aren't super easy to pull. Uh, Lavishka. Brandon Ayuk. Chase Young. Nice looking Gridiron Kings. Uh, oh, there we go. Nice Joe Burrow. I forgot all about Burrow and Herbert because I haven't pulled any of them yet. <laughs> nice Burrow. Gridiron Kings. Good looking pitcher there. Jonathan Taylor. <clears throat> and T. Higgins. There we go. So that was a pretty good pack. A couple good ones in there. Jefferson Burrow, you know. Chase Young, obviously good. Let's see what we get here. Oh, and then that Prism Black, you know. That's a good one. That's a pretty tough pull. So Gronk. I got all lots of Gronks I put away. I love Gronk. Buckus. Broadway Joe. DeAndre Swift rookie. Sean Alexander, great football player back in the day. Aaron Darnold, the greatest defensive tackle possibly of all time. Uh, Michael Pittman Jr. Omega, Chase Young guy. Pull a lot of Chase Youngs. Here's a nice one. Is the Legacy, DeAndre Swift Legacy rookie. That's a pretty good looking card. Uh, not a super easy pull out of these. Uh, Jerry Judy, Jonathan Taylor again. Clyde Edwards, Jalen Hurts, who could be a darn good football player. We'll see how. We'll see what happens with him. Brandon Ayuk and the last card for this break, guys. And it's going to be uh, Mr. Jeffrey Akuda. Akuda Matata. Just kidding. All right, that's it for today, guys. Uh, don't forget to go ahead and check out my little buddies over here. And they got a really nice dad and mom. Dad's name is Roger. I didn't catch the mom's name. 
Uh, go check out their channel. They did an interview with me at the card show. Pretty entertaining. Uh, if you guys watch your videos, just so you know, you're going to get sucked right in because their, <laughs> their love for the hobby and cards is infectious. And I can't wait to do a break with them. A little collaboration video. So, all right, guys. Stay tuned for the next video. Give it a thumbs up if you like this video. Uh, can't wait. I just found out that the Long Beach Expo is on for September. Uh, so we will be going there. We'll be doing an awesome video. And uh, hopefully PSA will have some decent prices on something. I haven't figured out what anything's going to be yet. So I don't know what the heck I'm going to bring. But as soon as I find out uh, what grading fees are going to be on bulk or whatever, then I'll decide what's going. I'll give you guys a little preview video, show you what's getting sent off. And then we'll do the return video whenever the heck it comes back. So you guys have a great rest of the day. Uh, thanks again to... Um, to Ross and Magda over there in Toronto for the letter. I really appreciate it. Uh, hopefully you guys have a lot of success doing the the uh, TTMs. Uh, just so you guys know, I am also doing a bunch of more TTMs right now. I'm sending them out. So stay tuned for some more TTM videos. Those seem to be my most popular videos. I'm sorry I don't do a lot more of them, but I will, I will send out 40, 50 things um, here this month, and then we'll see what we get back. So you guys have a great rest of the day, and I will see you soon. Later.